From untamed lands to fields of green and gold, Alfalfa County has resonated with the spirit of the early pioneer. In 1893, a mighty wave of people came from the north in Kansas to settle on the prairie. Claims were staked and covered wagons filled with pots, pans, and meager possessions canopied the land. Dugouts became living quarters while dwellings made of sod were being built. The only remaining original sod house in Oklahoma stands in the southern part of the county at Aline. The men planted crops, the women tended the gardens, and soon life was etched out on the prairies. Towns, businesses, and schools began popping up as crops flourished. One hundred years later, agriculture remains the strength of the economy and the way of life here. The colorful stories of early days are still told at the local coffee shops. Stories like the one about a man named Pat who painted red barns in the northern part of the county. No one ever knew his past or anything about his family. His grave lies just inside the gates of the Byron Amarita Cemetery. And Johnny Potts, a cowboy who was gunned down when alcohol and cards combined for a deadly shootout on the famous T5 Ranch. His life is remembered by a marker in the Cherokee Cemetery. Alfalfa County, our horizons know no limit. Our midnight skies, sunrises, and sunsets cause us to imagine what the early settlers and pioneers must have envisioned here. Alfalfa County is rich in history and heritage, and we invite you to explore over 800 square miles of prairies, plains, nature, and fun. Remember, there are many other great tourism destinations in Alfalfa County, and we hope you'll visit them all.